Welcome to M-Advisor Office Hours. I'm Paul Morton. Today we're talking about tax brackets and how tax rates work. We're looking at 2024 tax brackets for single filers and married filing jointly. So if we look at just single filers for a moment, the tax brackets are set up in individual brackets. And the way the tax system works is it's a progressive system. So as you fill these tax brackets with income, your first dollars are taxed at 10%. And then the next tax bracket, anything above that $11,600 up to $47,149 is taxed at 12%. And so as you move on up, looking at someone who makes $250,000, they have roughly $7,000 taxed at 35%. So they got pushed into the highest tax bracket, but the first $243,000 of their $250,000 income is essentially unaffected. If we look at the married filing jointly tax brackets, you can see it's exactly double the single filing tax brackets because instead of accounting for one person, you have two people in the married filing jointly tax brackets. So if we look at $250,000 of income on married filing jointly, that puts them right here in the 24% tax bracket. So their total tax, if you calculate the total tax of $250,000 for a single filer, it puts them in the 35% marginal tax bracket. And their total tax paid without deductions is going to be $57,874. And taken as a percentage of tax paid versus their total income, that puts them in the 23% effective tax rate. An effective tax rate just means what is the total percent of your income that you pay in taxes. Now, looking at the married filing jointly tax brackets, these are bigger tax brackets, so it takes more income to fill each bracket. So $250,000, the highest tax in a marginal tax rate that they're going to pay is 24% versus 35 for the single filer. So $250,000 is going to create a tax before deductions of about $46,085. That means that they are in an 18% effective tax rate. That means of their $250,000, uh, $250, they pay roughly 18% of their total income in taxes, meaning they have an 18% effective tax rate. And in short, that is how tax brackets work.